very exciting day. Today we have Bankai Impact 3rd Part 2 First Look. So don't be confused by that. But no, in all seriousness, a very monumental moment uh, for Bankai Impact 3rd. This game came out in, I believe it was October of 2016. So this has been going on for a very long time. So the fact that we're getting a part two is a very, very like mo monumentous moment. And um, yeah, I have no idea what to expect. I haven't seen anything about this yet. And this is a, a big step for, for Honkai Impact 3rd. I guess still the same title, just part two. So let's see what they they got in store. Hyperon 11. User Helio. 2.0. I say Mars. That way. Hey there, I'm that way, your old friend. Hong Kong back. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Who uh -oh. has been with us for seven years? Where was this at the whole time, that way? <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, that's really awesome that he's actually he took the, the chance to go and speak English. That's after part one, the moon's origin and Seven humanity, years. and ongoing part 1.5, dance of life and death. The story of Hong Kong Impact 3rd continues. Let's go. Our new chapter will unfold on a new planet, Mars. Yeah. The spaceship bound for Mars is about to set off. Let's have a sneak peek at the trailer first. Going to Mars. Hmm. All right, this is it. This is... Helio. God, this look already looks sick. Windows 11. Crash landing? Nope. Oh, wait. Somebody else was there? Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> This is Mars, all this? So Wolf. Nah, that can't be. No, it is yeah, it's the same symbol. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, Hold on. Got back third part two 2024 in february welcome back part two of Hong Kong impact third hmm. we mark a new step made by the franchise marching from the earth's moon system to the <laughs> yeah, i love system. english that way on mars we will embark on a new adventure as an original resident on this planet huh. it's time to embrace the exotic natural views and a civilization. It kind of lost me at the end of that trailer a little bit. And we will encounter new partners from different culture backgrounds. Of course, aside from the new story, we will have a full <laughs> upgrade of the combat experience. 
Oh. We believe that the compact design based on Astro Ring will provide a brand new experience. Okay. Now, let's check out the gameplay demo to know more about the compact on Mars. I mean, it was already kind of cool before, so let's see what they do now. Yeah, 2016. He said seven years. It's crazy. Also, the vibe. Still in development, of course. I can't believe this is happening. Oh, no. They are not. Are we going to actually do this? Also, this is a bop. Hmm. Reminds me of like a like an indie game. Funny enough. So this can't, this can't be Mars, right? There's no way. This has to be like the other... The one girl was in Mars and the other girl must have been wherever this is. I mean, unless it is. I don't make the rules. And... That kind of reminded me of, uh, food. <laughs> that kind of looks like the symbol from ZZZ. New enemies? Kind of look harmless, actually. <laughs> Uh, not anymore. Okay. Oh. They're like, yeah. Okay, so kind of like the same slow down time mechanic they had there. Oh god, flying enemies. Ooh. Nice day, okay. Huh. Oh, he switched, I didn't even notice. Oh, the combo move? She has like two yo-yos. Nice. Oh. <laughs> How many times? Jeez, please. All right. Gonna say a little bit. Some more. Similar looking enemies. All right. That's not bad. That's the, the double combat As move. As you can see from the demo, the combat experience will be enriched and diversified in Hong Kong Impact 3rd. The adventure on Mars will bring new stories, new themes, and a new combat system. Before the official release, we will refine every detail to perfection and mm. create a new journey exclusive to Hong Kong Impact 3rd. It has been seven years since Hong Kong Impact 3rd's debut. Their baby. And I'm grateful for your unwavering support. Your support has enabled us to keep writing positive and wholesome stories on the new planet. All your monies. No. The fighting spirit <laughs> is about to burn brightly 
on an alien planet. See you on Mars. Enthusiastic. That was, no, 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 no. That wasn't, nine minutes didn't go by, right? No. Wow, all right. Well, yeah, that seems very exciting, actually. Um, I have to take a look at Honkai Pack 3rd again to see the exact differences between like the old one, the old and the new. But yeah, just her constantly doing that slam over and over and over again. But yeah, I mean, it looks good. Um, I'm thinking maybe this time I can jump on the bandwagon and like be there from the start, at least this time for part two. He did say a whole new adventure, new story, you know, new scene. So it's like, it's an upgrade, but it's a new adventure. You know, it's a whole different kind of story. So I don't doubt they'll have things from the older games be in there as well. But at the same time, you know, if this is a brand new story, it will be worth just trying to get into it on day one instead of, you know, jumping into it later and then kind of being confused and just that and the third. So. And, you know, I wonder how they're going to do it. I wonder how it, they're going to include the old stuff or if they won't include it at all. You can run around in Honkai Impact 3rd with certain scenarios, scenarios like uh, with the Yai Sakura missions and everything like that. Like that. But, yeah, this is kind of like a kind of surreal to be walking around like in the city like this where it's all pristine and modern, you know. So, looking forward to it. The characters look nice. The handful that we got so far. And um, yeah, apparently going to Mars. I want to see more of Mars, actually. I want to see more of like us on that planet. And like I guess I could be wrong. Don't know if this is including Mars right here on the screen or if this is like a whole different area. But <laughs> if this is on Mars, and <laughs> I don't know what's going on over there. But but overall, this is really good because the flame chasers and like, you know, Kiana's adventure. And, you know, we saw the DeCapo, the video we saw a little bit ago. All of that pretty much essentially wrapped things up, you know, and we got trailers that insinuated that things are kind of done, you know, things are over. So, I mean, you know, you can keep on trying to keep that same adventure going or you can just end it and it can be its solidified story that is, you know, the Honkai Impact third story or Kiana's arc or, you know, whatever you want to call it. But when you start part two, you just start fresh. You know, and now you have a whole new thing, a whole new protagonist. And, you know, you can have references and whatnot. But, like, I, I think going this direction is a good idea. Just just to have things be completely fresh. People can still play Honkai Impact 3rd if they enjoyed it, for, you know, before. They'll have that same enjoyment, but it'll just be a new experience within the same thing. You know, so it's a great step in the right direction. New characters, new everything. And, um... Yeah, looking forward to it. 2024 in February, look like, or maybe it was like a little bit later, but it should just be next year. So, so what do you guys think about it? Are you, what are you excited for exactly? Do you like the new characters? Are you still gonna miss Kiana? Are you still gonna be thinking about the old uh, adventures and whatnot, or is it gonna just be, you know, fully immersed into the new adventure at this point? You know, and I do wonder what they're gonna do when it comes to the gacha, like you know, part two. Is it just gonna update the old game? You'll have all the old character? Like, I don't know, but that's kind of a jarring experience. Like, what if you pulled so many characters in Icon Impact 3rd and now a part two comes out? Then what happens, you know? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. But once again, what do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comments. But that'll be all for me. I will catch you guys in the next one.